off to the Melbourne Derby, the Christmas Derby should I say. And uh, of course because the trains are not working too well today, we are driving. Joined with my brother, Melbourne City fan. Let's go City. We have officially arrived. It is Derby Day and we are excited. Come on, Dictory. So the intended plan is to go to the march where the North Terrace, or as they're called now, original style Melbourne, are going to be, which is at a, the Cricketers Hotel, I believe, which is kind of just down there. So we're gonna go there now. I don't know how they're gonna feel with this guy wearing a city top, so maybe he'll stay away for now. Um, but yeah, that's the plan, let's go. <laughs> Defensively, we look very solid and attacking wise it looks a lot more fluid as well We have our fullbacks pushing up a lot higher, uh, which is good to see Also, I think Elvis has been man of the match for me so far this game Defensively, he's been closing down Brillante there and going forward he provides space And I don't think uh, Toivonen's coming in pretty deep, which he's used to doing He's not doing that today, which is actually helping in Elvis to make the runs that he's doing today So it's been pretty good and Hoogland coming in for his first game, he's done so well, commanded the defence and he's really guided everyone else that's around him so uh, it's good to see Victory coming back and doing 
what they've done throughout the past few years. Safe to say we look like the better side. As of late in the first half, we lost them a little bit, but we were definitely the, the better team, the better Melbourne side here. So we'll see what the second half has to bring and hopefully victory come out on top because I think we deserve this game. So we're joined here by my mate Pete and his son, Tom, Thomas Ross. already started but I think the biggest problem with victory in the second half is moving Elvis out wide he's clearly been our best player in center mid now he's pushed Robbie Cruz in the central position I have no idea why he decided to do that Elvis was really good on the ball defensively he was sound kept the defensive midfielder shut the whole time so 